Also a very tragic story in the news today. More than 100 people injured, one dead in New Jersey Transit Hoboken crash. A commuter train barreled into the terminal of the New Jersey Transit Station Thursday, leaving 108 people injured and at least one dead among massive damage. And there was images of people coming out. One gentleman that I saw this morning who's kind of got blood, you know, dripping down his shirt. Uh, looks like there was a lot of injuries. Not sure many how many dead yet. The rush hour wreck happened around 8.45 a.m., obliterating part of the station's roof, mangling steel beams, and smashing glass. I thought we were going to die, passenger Alexis Valley said, who is five months pregnant and needed four staples on her head after the crash, and hope, hopefully that her, her youngin's okay uh, as well, a pregnant lady. You can go through these images here, and you see the commotion. In fact, let's go to a quick video right now to see kind of what the after effects of this damage looked like. So again, folks, I hope everybody's... So again, folks, hope everybody's okay, but the first thought that popped in my mind, and probably many of yours, is this terrorism. Now, just about a week or so ago, there were explosive devices found and detonated near an Elizabeth train station not too far away from this particular location. Now, my initial gut reaction was and is, this is not terrorism, but this story is developing. And so we'll have to see if this is linked, once again, to the massive migration push, pushed by people like George Soros, these very evil men, that not, not only donate millions of dollars to the terrorist organization that makes up Black Lives Matter, but also the super PACs that make up Hillary Clinton's campaign. I've got to go to a quick break. I'm Christopher Green. You're tuning into AMTV Alternative Media Television. Thank you so much for your support. Again, the price of a cup of coffee, $4.95 a month, $49.95 a year. Get our entire broadcast completely commercial and ad-free. We'll be right back. Hard-hitting and in your face.